Hi, Laura Adler, Holistic Health Coach, here for another video in the 30 Videos for 30 Days Challenge. And today I want to talk about cookware. I got an email the other day from a colleague asking me what my thoughts were on some of the new green technology non-stick and non-teflon coated pans. So I thought I'd use this opportunity to give her an answer and you an answer in this video. So what's the deal with nonstick cookware and toxins? Um, the deal is this. Nonstick cookware, traditional nonstick cookware, is made with a um, chemical called PFOA. Um, Teflon is a brand name, much like Kleenex is a brand name for tissues, but I'll use that to refer to all nonstick. Um, so Teflon contains a chemical called PFOA. PFOA um, has been shown to cause um, cancer and birth defects. Um, sadly, it shows up in the blood of 98% of Americans, and this is a chemical that is both persistent in our bodies and persistent in our, in our environment, meaning it doesn't biodegrade, it doesn't go anywhere ever, 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 um, and it bioaccumulates bio in our bodies. Um, it's even been found in the blood of Arctic polar bears. That's just to show you how far-reaching this chemical is. You don't have to be using it in your kitchen to be exposed to it. It just persists in the environment. So, when we use Teflon-coated pans, we expose ourselves daily to these type of chemicals. The manufacturers of these pots and pans claim that the chemicals that are released are released at much higher temperatures above and beyond what constitutes normal use, but studies have shown um, that that's quite the opposite, that's, that these chemicals are released at very normal levels of use. So I say it's best to avoid chemicals um, in your cookware as often as possible and therefore avoid Teflon pans or non-stick coated pans. As for these new technology um, pots and pans, a lot of them are using um, nanotechnology, ceramic coating, or silica-based coatings, um, but I don't really know enough about them, and the, these products are so new on the market that the research just hasn't been done. Um, reviews of these products say that some work better than others, um, but for me the jury is out, and I much prefer to err on the side of caution and use cookware that has been around for many, many years and has um, absolutely no um, health risks associated with them whatsoever. So what are those pots and pans? First and foremost, stainless steel. It's a standard. Um, get you know a really good quality set of stainless steel and it will last you a lifetime. Yes, it's more expensive, but you buy it once and you never buy it again. Um, if you cook with it properly, it can be fairly close to non-stick. Um, my other favorite pan of choice is of course cast iron. This is a honking large cast iron skillet that I use for everything. This is made by Lodge. Cast iron is nature's original non-stick coating. If you treat this well, you can cook an egg on this and have it slide off. Um, what's great is that these are really, really inexpensive. Um, so cost is not a barrier when it comes to good quality cookware. Cast iron will also last you a lifetime. Um, and the third and most often used pot in my house is this big enameled cast iron Dutch oven. Um, this is the same, it's also really heavy, um, but it's got an enamel coating on the inside which um, serves as an additional non-stick type coating, um, but it's totally safe and is good for high temperatures um, and any temperature really. Um, and uh, it doesn't retain any smells or colors and it will also last you a lifetime. So um, if you have Teflon pots and pans in your house, I don't say throw them out because that's really wasteful. I'm a big fan of reusing um, whenever possible. If they're scratched, definitely get rid of them because that Teflon coating is coming right off in your food. Um, if they're really good quality, use them well, cook with them at low, low temperatures and you're fine. Um, that's it. If you have other questions, if you're wondering more things about cookware, food, health, nutrition, shoot me an email at laura at lauraadler.com. You can access that email address through my website, www.lauraadler.com. Uh, or you can comment on this video either on YouTube or on Facebook. Thanks. Uh, see you soon. Bye.